eat revenge. President Trump just unleashes revenge on Democrats, Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi are scared stiff. Back right around 10 years prior, Barack Hussein Obama was authoritarian to the NTH degree, never wishing to address a Republican delegation and, truth be told, closing them out of closed-door meetings on different events, much to the alarm of the Republicans in Congress. When he lost the lion's share in Congress, regardless he figured out how to hone in isolation from the Republicans by a duration of these strategies, the main prominent special case being Speaker John Boner, who has just as of late uncovered how he never talked in gleaming terms about Obama basically in light of the fact that he would be seen by conservatives as the devil incarnate. Obviously, he was Obama's BFF on the fairway. Is it any ponder that he at long last lost his capacity to lead? Donald Trump is an alternate kind of president. Above all else, he is a man who appreciates seeing harmony and comedy and expectations that all sides will meet up in a coordinated vision without bounds of the sauce nation. After as of late welcoming the Democrat initiative to a meeting to air their grievances and talk in candid terms, the donkey delegation rather selected to go out into the rotunda and address columnists about how they were dismissing him. Trump, ever the reality TV host, set up two purge seats for Nancy and Chuck and afterward got them out for being truant. Via Mad World News On Tuesday, top Democrats on Capitol Hill canceled an important meeting at the very last minute that they had scheduled with President Donald Trump. Moments later, Trump unleashed a brutal reality check which the insolent liberals sorely needed. Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer and House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi decided at the last minute on Tuesday that they would cancel a meeting with President Trump on tax reform. Their immature decision came after Trump sent out a tweet earlier in the day which hurt their fragile feelings. Meeting with Chuck and Nancy today about keeping government open and working, Trump tweeted. Problem is they want illegal immigrants flooding into our country unchecked are weak on crime and want to substantially raise taxes. I don't see a deal. None of this was untrue, nor was it particularly rude or the least bit threatening. On the contrary, the president simply took to social media to lay out the facts, as he often does. It is important that he continues to do so, as well, because the mainstream media has refused to offer unbiased coverage of the Trump administration thus far. Shortly after Trump sent out the aforementioned tweet, Chuck and Nancy canceled their meeting at the last minute, citing the lamest of excuses. Given that the president doesn't see a deal between Democrats and the White House, we believe the best path forward is to continue negotiating with our Republican counterparts in Congress instead, the pair said in a joint statement. President Trump responded by saying that he was not really that surprised over the Democratic leader's last-minute cancellation highlighting just how immature they really are. Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi did not show up for our meeting today. I'm not really that surprised. We have a lot of differences, remarked Trump. The president found another hilarious way to shame Pelosi and Schumer after their childish move, as well. He moved forward with his meeting, leaving a seat on either side of him empty where the Democratic leaders would have been seated. The contrasts between Barack Hussein Obama and Donald Trump are to be sure huge and glaring. From one perspective, you had a man bowed on the decimation of an incredible country who named its dominant part racists, its cops hooligans, and its enterprises cheat while lauding offenders in Black Lives Matter, Antifa, and the Muslim Brotherhood. On the other, you have a man who is uniquely centered around making America great again through endeavors that will make us more secure more gainful, more grounded, and having pride in ourselves that has for some time been absent. What do you think about this? Do not hesitate and write your thoughts in the comments section below. Thank you for reading. Reading.